Good evening, I'm meteorologist Karen Williams and we have cooler, drier conditions around the region. And as you can see by tonight, our outer fringes are going to be in the upper 40s while areas to the west and down to our south will be in the low 50s. How long will that last? I'll have your detailed forecast coming up as the Delta News Weekend Edition at 10 starts now. News that works for you. This is the Delta News at 10. And now let's switch gears and check in with meteorologist Karen Williams for a look of the weather. Karen, how's it looking out? Well, Tamara, outside our studios, we have clear conditions, but it's also getting cool outside. Your full forecast after the break. As you can see by our radar and clouds here, we're just going to zoom in just a little bit. There are a few showers developing, but they're far out of our area. And the only thing that we may get is down to our south. You may see a few clouds here and there, but as you travel up to the north, it's going to be mainly a clear sky type of event. There are wind advisories that appear that pretty much are out of our area for the most part, but mainly it's going to be a chilly one tonight. Our temperatures will be in the low 50s. Now looking at your out the door forecast, it's shaping up like this. By 7 a.m. we'll have plenty of sunshine, 54 degrees. Then 1 p.m. still plenty of sunshine, 72 degrees. And then 7 p.m. 69 degrees. Now right now in Greenwood it's 58 degrees with a south wind 3 miles per hour. The humidity at 87 percent and that dew point at 54 degrees. So that is a little bit dry. The barometric pressure is at 30 point two. That's what I'm trying to say. Now, Greenville, you are at 61 degrees and the winds are out of the out of the west southwest there at seven miles per hour. And then the humidity is at 70 percent and that dew point at 51 degrees. Now, as we advance a little bit further here, we're looking at our future cast and pretty much the temperatures will pretty much rebound during the day. It will be a little chilly in the morning. And as you can see, by Monday evening, there's a possibility of a little light shower that might move into the area. I think this particular model is a little bit overdone, but I think we'll will be safe for the most part. Looking at the 24 hour temperature difference is 12 degrees cooler down in Bastrop and six degrees cooler down in Vicksburg. Now looking again here, our future cast, we want to put that in motion here. You see clouds moving in. Then by Monday morning, there's a few little showers up to the extreme north, one or two down towards between Cleveland and parts of Greenwood. It might be a little shower to develop, maybe a little spritz or two, but for the most part, those winds are going to shift back to the south. Looking at our high temperatures toward the week, we're going to be running above normal for this time of the year. As you can see, our warmest day will be Friday at 81, along with Saturday at 85 degrees. Now, chances for rain, we're looking at Tuesday 20% and Wednesday would be the greater chance, but there's a possibility of a system that may just travel down a little bit towards south toward us that we might see some of those drizzle and showers. Now looking at the Mississippi River near Greenville, we're still running about a, about a foot, a little bit over a foot above flood stage and the projection for Wednesday is 48.9. And then for the Yazoo River level, we're below flood stage, but notice we start to come down by Wednesday at 30.2. Looking at your forecast, we'll have clear skies. It'll be breezy, 53 degrees. Winds out of the west, northwest, 15 to 20 miles per hour. And then looking at your forecast for tomorrow, we're looking at sunny skies, breezy, 74 degrees with some gusts there. And then for your seven day forecast shaping up, we'll have mostly sunny skies for Monday, 74 degrees. We have that outside chance for that little disturbance late Tuesday 78 degrees and then Wednesday that's when we will have the bigger chance for showers 77 degrees but we pretty much stay a little bit above normal and especially on Friday you're looking about 80 to 85 degrees by the weekend. 